this was brought to us by Fair Lisa. Um, I seen our seen our advert online while I was looking for a wee cob, just a wee project to bring on and show in. And we went down to see our brought her in for a groom. Decided then and there I wanted her. I just I just seen the potential in her. I think that this little hairy cob in the field with tons of feather and tons of hair would do fab in the show ring. And she's got a lovely temperament. She's definitely cheeky, but she's really willing to work. She's got a big attitude in there, but she's super loving. We went up to see her before it applied for, seen her in the field, went along and asked some of the grooms about her, and then applied for her and we came back up to see her, brought her in for a groom, chatted to them about her history and stuff, and then they sent someone to look at the yard. And basically from about a month of seeing her the first she was here. We clicked pretty quickly. She's been lovely to do everything with. She was a bit nervous when she first arrived and it was only me, really me that could catch her. And she's just, she's just come on super well. She loves everyone on the yard. And everyone loves her. So we got her as Companion with Potential. She was backed last October for a month and then turned away for the whole winter. She was turned away for about eight months and then I brought her back into work a couple of months ago and just in walk and trot, taking her out. She's been out showing in hand. Um, she went to her first ever dressage competition two weeks ago, went to her first ever showing under saddle two weeks ago and we come back with lov lovely comments from the judges on her. Lots to work on. We qualified for traditional of the year on our first ever show out, but unfortunately she wasn't registered. So our next show got her registered, qualified again, missed out this year because I'd had an accident. But our first show back out two weeks ago, we've qualified for both in hand and the quest for a star for traditional of the year for next year. And we've also qualified for the Caledonia Championships in October, which will be really good. I'm hoping to take our show in under saddle. We're hoping to qualify for Equifest next year. Um, take her down and do that. Probably in hand, but under saddle would be great. Get her to do some dressage. She's not a big jumping pony. <laughs> Maybe a wee bit of workers. If she decides she likes it. Basically, just whatever she wants to do, we'd love to do. If she just wants to be a hacking pony, that's all we'll do. But it would be really nice to get her out doing, showing her off show them what rescue ponies can do. It's been amazing seeing how well she's come on. If you're looking to rehome for Mortals Welfare, I would say definitely give it a go. They're lovely and supportive. Um, they'll answer any questions you've got. They'll try and suit the horse that you're looking at for you. And they'll come down and check on them, answer any questions. We've always got the uh, bonus that she can go back if she needs to and she'll get another really good home and they'll make sure she's looked after for life.